So I know my channel is called Timmy's Takeout and technically this isn't takeout, but also technically it kind of is. I took it out of the store. Of course I paid for it. <laughs> After preparing, I took it out of the store. So it's takeout. It's fine. So Doritos released these dips like a month and a half ago, and I've been meaning to try them. They look delicious, but so many things have been coming out in the new year that I haven't had time. But now I do because nothing came out at the end of this week. So yay. Even though Taco Bell was supposed to drop chicken wings today, which I was so hyped to try, but um, they delayed it to next week. But next week I'll be trying those. So stay tuned. The new Doritos dips come in two flavors. We have spicy nacho and we have Cool Ranch Jalapeno. Now Doritos are my favorite chip, not sponsored. I just prefer them to Pringles, Lay's, all of them. I love tortilla chips so much. So I'm really about to try these dips. I got three kinds of chips to try with them. We have just plain tortilla chips just to see how they taste kind of by themselves. And then of course I got some Cool Ranch, hello, and nacho cheese. So I'm gonna try all three chips with both dips and it's gonna be a great time. So give this video a big thumbs up if you're enjoying it. It really helps me out and I will chew the chips extra loudly if you don't, so. <laughs> also subscribe to my channel, Timmy's Takeout for more fast food reviews. Once in a while, a store-bought review and full menu taste test. It's a great time here. I'm sweating because I just worked out. <gasps> okay, first things first, I need a chip. I need it now, I'm hungry. <sighs> Oh my gosh. Mm. Cool Ranch Doritos are genuinely iconic. And nacho cheese. Listen, if these dips are good, I hope they make more flavors like Blazing Buffalo Ranch and Flamin' Hot. Let's open the dips up and see how they look. First up, spicy nacho. I'm nervous. Doritos first dips ever. We have a nice metallic seal. Huh? Ooh. Oh! That smells like pure jalapeno juice. Like pickled jalapeno juice. I love that. Oh my goodness. Smells so good, but also very processed, which could be a good thing or a bad thing. Sometimes very processed foods can taste amazing. It's just a fact. Okay, it smells very cheesy too. And then we have Cool Ranch Jalapeno. Okay. Ooh, look at that color. It's like a nice light, pale beige orange moment. They smell very surprisingly similar. This one definitely smells more cheesy. And this one smells a bit more creamy, but they do smell similar. Okay, so I'm gonna pause, get my thumbnail super quick, and then we'll start taste testing everything. I kinda wanna put a Dorito in each of them for the thumbnail, just to give it a cute look, like that. See, <laughs> cute, right? Oh, I love just being an aesthetically pleasing queen. Go it. Okay, let me set these chips aside, because first I wanna try each dip with a plain tortilla chip, just to really taste the flavor of the dip mainly before I bring in the other chip flavors. Can you get me? Of course, I'm gonna taste test each of these, give you my honest opinion, rate them from one to 10, and let you know if they're worth buying. At least in my opinion! Let's try first to the spicy nacho. Let's see that texture. Okay. Pretty thick, pretty nice, actually. Perfect, let's try it. There's some spice in there. It's actually kind of spicy. It's very interesting. It doesn't taste how it smells. I like it, I do. Ow. A chip got stuck in my gum for a second. <laughs> Goodness me! I'm enjoying this. I can't stop. It's very interesting. So first things first, it actually has a good amount of spice to it. To be honest, the spicy nacho flavor of Doritos really isn't that spicy, but 
this dip actually is. Now it isn't too spicy. It's like the perfect amount. The texture is very nice, thick, satisfying, and it really sticks to the chip. So that's great. Now flavor wise, it tastes like movie theater nacho cheese sauce, but a little less processed actually and a little less potent. That's like very strong, very tart. This is a little less, but it still has that jalapeno juice flavor. Now, it looks like it would be dairy filled, but to be honest, it almost has the flavor and texture of like a vegan cheese dip, even though I'm sure that it's not. It tastes like it was made with almond milk. There's a little bit of fat missing, if that makes sense, but it's still very good. It just, I feel like this isn't like a full fat dip. It feels like either low fat or like, almond milky do you get me it's very interesting it's good though it has a lot of flavor it almost tastes a tiny bit like refried beans for some reason just a hint i'm gonna give it a nice 7.5 out of 10. so now let's try the cool ranch jalapeno dip i'm so hyped oh yeah okay Mm. Oh, oh my god mm. Mm. this is so good i love it okay mm. so this one tastes a bit more fatty it has more of a real milk dairyish quality to it so that's good now let me tell you, it really tastes like a Cool Ranch chip. I am pretty sure they put the same seasoning blend from the chip into this dip because it tastes just like it. But it also has a hint of jalapeno, like it says. It tastes exactly like the name, Cool Ranch Jalapeno. There is no misleading titles happening here. It's very accurate. Now, this one does have a little bit more of a processed aftertaste. There's just like a hint of like fakeness in the back of my throat right now. But I think that overall, I like it more than the spicy nacho. Mm. I'm impressed. These dips are good. I'm going to give the Cool Ranch Jalapeno an 8.5. It's very strong. It's really delicious and almost like refreshing. It also has a tiny bit of spice to it, but a lot less spice than the spicy nacho. So there's that. Now, let's try both dips with Cool Ranch. Okay? Let's see, guys. Oh, my God. Mm. Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna be honest. I don't think the Cool Ranch chips go with the spicy jalapeno dip at all. The Cool Ranch chip really overshadows the spicy nacho flavor and really kind of just makes it taste like refried beans completely which is very interesting. It tastes like I am dipping my Cool Ranch chips into beans. Now I like beans, but I think that these chips really dim the spicy nachos light, you know? They make them like the backup dancer, but I do like the spice from the dip with the Cool Ranch chips. That's a great combo. So now let's try the Cool Ranch chips with the Cool Ranch dip. Oh yeah, let's <laughs> see. Oh my God, that works. Mm-hmm. Wow. It really is like the same flavor. I'm so impressed. Oh my God. Mmm. I can't stop. Mmm. So the Cool Ranch dip really just elevates the Cool Ranch chips and makes them taste 10 times more flavorful. Plus it gives them like a hint of sour cream and like refreshingness. If you love the Cool Ranch chips by themselves, you'll love them with the dip, wow. So, I think the Cool Ranch chips with the spicy nacho, I'm gonna give it a four out of 10. But the Cool Ranch chips with the Cool Ranch dip, I'm giving it a 10 out of 10. Last but not least, we're gonna try the nacho cheese chips with the dips. First, spicy nacho. Let's see. 
Okay. Okay. Hmm. Um, I think that the nacho cheese chips work a lot better with the spicy nacho than the cool ranch chips did, but still, to be honest, it tastes like I'm dipping my chips into refried beans with a different texture. And once again, the chips are overshadowing the dip and making it taste really like nothing. It's very bizarre. And I have to say, I think that the spicy nacho dip only works if you're having it with like plain tortilla chips. It does not work with other flavors because it always gets overshadowed. Very interesting. Wow, spicy nacho with the nacho cheese. I'm giving it a five out of 10. Now we're gonna try the nacho cheese chip with the Cool Ranch dip, okay? Mm. That works too! Wow, so good. It still has that processed flavor, but it works. Mm. So I'm giving the nacho cheese chips with the with the Cool Ranch dip a nine out of 10. So then, mm. so I think it's clear that both dips are good, but the spicy nacho only goes well with plain chips. The Cool Ranch goes well with everything. The flavors, the plain ones, everything. So I would mainly recommend the Cool Ranch version, but I'm very pleasantly surprised. I think Doritos ate this, they're great. But I just wanna clarify, I think you need to enjoy processed foods to enjoy these dips. So if you enjoy processed foods, I think that you'll like these a lot, especially the Cool Ranch. So give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments below. Do you plan on trying these dips or have you already? If you did, tell me all your thoughts. Subscribe. I'll see you next video. I love you so much. Oh, oh, oh.